Item number sign, SCP-019 Object Class, Character Special Containment Procedures. SCP-019 is to be placed on a wide grate in a 3 meters x 3 meters x 4 meters room made of reinforced concrete, installed with an incinerator. Room is to be kept at 0, 0 degrees Celsius when incinerator is not activated. An observation chamber separated by a plate glass window is to be used for constant observation of SCP-019, and a flash when specimens of SCP-019-2 are observed. The incinerator is to be activated. In case of an outbreak of SCP-0192, ordinary firearms were successful in terminating individual specimens, although in the case of a swarm level outbreak, flamethrowers may be more effective. SCP-019 should be kept in a vertical position at all times. Description, SCP-019 appears to be a very large ceramic vase, 1.8 meters in diameter at the mouth and 2.4 meters high. Style and decoration indicate it was created in classical Greece, although conclusive dating is impossible, as the surface is entirely unbreakable by any known means. If a successful method is discovered, SCP-019 is to be destroyed with prejudice. Periodically, entities emerge from SCP-019. Collectively, these are known as SCP-0192. The entities vary in many aspects, but tend to be small. Vaguely humanoid though they may have animoid features and extremely hostile. They often choose to attack with teeth or claws. Although fairly delicate also, surprisingly, flammable they are reasonably strong and pose a considerable threat in large numbers. When kept at 0, 0 degrees Celsius and totally at rest, entities will emerge from SCP-019 at a rate of approximately 1 1 entity per hour. The following traits are known to affect SCP-019 to S manifestation rate, movement of SCP-019 threat to SCP-019 extreme temperature in either direction sudden shift in surrounding environment in general introduction of objects or organisms to the inside of SCP-019 known to cause a flood reaction traits that may or may not influence SCP-019 to S manifestation rate presence of human life near SCP-019 current weather patterns specific individuals near SCP-019 some individuals seem to affect SCP-019 to S emergence rate more drastically than others in addition keeping or tilting SCP-019 will create a reaction as though it was previously filled with SCP-019 to specimens although viewers looking into SCP-019 from above will merely note a dark hole Due to the production rates of SCP-019-2 when the object is disturbed, measurement of the internal cavity is difficult, but it is suspected to be inconsistent with outside measurements. Addendum, document SCP-019-2 a SCP-019-2 notes, has maintained by Dr. Light and Dr. Vorx vertical line vertical line slash vertical line vertical line slash vertical line vertical line vertical line vertical line SCP-019 to specimen was removed from containment chamber and kept in reinforced pen, provided with water and lit chickens as food. Specimen made quiet, continuous, garbled vocalizations, determined to be phonetically similar to ancient Hellenic languages. Although the reason for this is unknown, Specimens are still thought to be no more intelligent than animals. The specimen only lived for under 48 hours, and a dissection revealed anatomy consistent on a cellular level with normal biology, but with an extremely unstable musculoskeletal structure. Other notable anomalies included an unstable respiratory system, next to no digestive tract, and virtually no other internal organs. All other captured specimens have followed similar patterns of behavior and demise. Note, it appears that SCP-019-2 specimens were not intended to live for meaningful amounts of time outside of SCP-019. DR. Vorx vertical line vertical line slash vertical line vertical line slash vertical line vertical line vertical line vertical line containment unit was slightly damaged following prolonged exposure to SCP-019-2 specimen, missed by the monitoring team because of partial transparency. This has not been noted in SCP-0192 before. Monitoring teams will continue to report further anomalies. Vertical line vertical line slash vertical line vertical line slash vertical line vertical line vertical line vertical line monitoring teams report some specimens of SCP-0192 now appear to be significantly more resistant to incineration than others. It is hypothesized that this is a defense mechanism on the part of SCP-019.
vertical line vertical line flash vertical line vertical line flash vertical line vertical line vertical line vertical line most specimens of SCP-0192 are now all but entirely resistant to the effects of the incinerator replacement of incinerator with an acid bath is being considered evolution of SCP-0192 is being studied and may be evidence of sentience in SCP-019